Hi there guys and thanks for joining me for another short little clipette. Today I'm just talking about something that I posted on my Instagram uh, and Facebook about a week or so ago, something like that, and people have been commenting on it as well as the Susie stuff and the Lorena McKinnett live at the Royal Albert Hall album which has just come out as well which I'll also talk about. Um, and this was in the background uh, when I've done some videos and stuff like that and people have said you know con congrats on that as uh, as well as everything else seems to be like a few things coming up roses at the moment which is great you know careers go up and down and all over the place and a lot of really you know juicy good things are happening at the moment um, and one of them uh, was receiving uh, another Grammy certificate which is which is great um, I, ha I hadn't claimed it and actually I think it was Paul Wertico, um the drummer who mentioned on one of the Palace Drum Camp, uh, Palace Drum Clinic lockdown chats that we used to have on Saturdays with Matt Green, myself and Pete Cater, uh, with various, you know, drumming legends. We did uh, Carl Palmer, Paul Wertico, um, oh, we did loads, I can't remember, there's, there's many. Uh, Ian Matthews, of course, that was a very boozy mm, and enjoyable one. Um, anyway, and he said that, uh, you know, I should collect a, a few certificates that, you know, I can claim. Um, and I'm also on a, a, a kind of a quest at the moment to pick up some uh, platinum and gold um, and silver discs as well from stuff I've played on. And if anybody out there knows how I can go about that, that would be great. Um, because I want to get some of those from some of the artists that I've worked with. And I know some sales have been very, very good. Certainly the Laura Pacini ones. Um, and they're the actual two Grammy certificates that I've got for working with Laura on the album uh, Simile. Um, and the other one, which uh, I always forget the name, but Hazte Sent. I'm sure I'm saying this terribly wrong, but Hazte Sentier. I'm sure that's not how you say it, how you pronounce it. But I had the other certificate for ages for Simile, which was like um, for performing on the album. I played on some tracks. I think Jerry Brown played on some. Uh, and I got a certificate for that. And she she, was, she didn't win that year. It was a runner-up, but it was still nice to have that certificate. Um, but this one was for the winning album. So I'm sure I haven't pronounced it properly, but it's nice to have this. And it's also embossed here with the, the Grammy logo emblem. And it's just nice to receive a winning certificate. And the winning certificate came in in this as well, whereas the other sort of runners up one, you just get sealed nicely in an envelope. You don't get this whole sort of card situation. So um, it's great to have this. So that means I've got two Grammy certificates, kind of a runners up and a winners, yay. And again, I didn't play drums on the whole album. I played uh, on three tracks and I played percussion as well on those tracks and uh, I worked alongside David Rossi and uh, D uh, David Rhodes from Peter Gabriel's band and Charlie Jones was on bass. And uh, the sessions were just very, very good fun. Down at uh, Riverside Studios, which is owned by Seb Pachia. Uh, and yeah, it's just nice to look at it and you know, my name, Rob O'Brien, in recognition of your participation as a musician on the Latin Grammy Award winning recording, Haste Sentir, I think. <laughs> Best Traditional Pop Vocal Album, the 19th Annual Grammy Awards, November 2018. And I just never claimed it, and I finally claimed it, so it's nice to have it. So what I need to do next is I need to find somebody who can actually um, put these into nice frames for me, because at the moment they're just kind of loose. The, the, the runners-up one I have got in a frame, but it doesn't fit, and I just put it in there to keep it safe. I had a spare frame, but it's way oversized for what, what's needed. Um, but yeah, so that's what, that's what it looks like, that's what it is. Unfortunately, we don't get that, but that's embossed as well. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, we don't get one of these. Obviously, the, the singer, Laura, gets that. And she held it up. And it was great because actually I'd come back from, when she'd won it, I stayed up late because I'd come back from a tour of South America with Lorena McKinnett. And I knew that the, the, the award ceremony was on and I decided to stay up and watch it live. And I remember putting on Facebook when this category came up. Um, I wrote on Facebook something like, oh, here we go, let's see what happens. And then two minutes later, I was like, we won, yay. <laughs> and it was kind of a really good moment, jumping up and down in a living room at like two in the morning or three in the morning our time because of the time difference. Um, anyway, so that's what that is. So thanks for all the people saying congrats. It is nice to get something like this. 
I'm sure if dad was around, he'd be proud to see it. Certainly now my mum is. Um, and so am I. So these will be up on the wall at some point. Uh, and yes, let's hope we can get back a few more before uh, these bones get too old to play and need more drums. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. This is just a little fun bit that, as I say, people have asked me what it looks like. Ooh, what's it like? So I thought I'd just do a little bit on that. The runners up one I think I've done before. It's over there in the frame and it's all wonky, so I'm not gonna bring it over because it looks silly. Um, but yeah, so thanks for tuning in. Uh, thank you for subscribing. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. Uh, and also hit the bell so you get notifications of when my videos come out. But I try to do them every Tuesday and Friday if I can, plus little bits in between. Again, if I've got something to talk about or something cool happens or I think of something while I'm behind the kit. So thanks a lot for tuning in, guys. Have a great week. Have a great weekend, wherever you're watching this. Have a great month. Have a great year. Uh, and I'll see you soon. Cheers.